In today's video, we will learn how to connect our ESP32 to a Wi-Fi network and that's coming up right after the intro. Every video I create, I believe in helping you create new technology that can be innovative and creative. The way I create my videos is by making a wide variety of basic IT videos that are easy to understand and will create a base for your future IT creations. My tutorials will include IoT devices, design, databases, websites, apps and so much more. Hello world, my name is Asali, meaning basic in the language Hasa. Today's video, we'll be learning how to connect our ESP32 to a Wi-Fi network. After we are able to connect to our router, we'll try to ping to our ESP32. For this video, I'll assume your ESP32 is ready for use. If you haven't used your ESP32 yet or don't know how to set it up, then check this video out in the upper right corner on screen now, or the link in the description down below for further instructions. Let's start by including the needed Wi-Fi library. Now we can create two characters, one for our SSID and one for the password. Make sure you fill up your SSD, SSID and password yourself. Next we can start in our void setup by adding in a serial.begin. And after this we want to begin connecting through Wi-Fi with our, with our router. And let's immediately print a line after this too. Next up we want to open up a while loop which will check our, wi will check our Wi-Fi status whether we are connected or not. And as long as we are not connected, we will print out a dot every, ha every half a second. Once the while loop is over, we can print out that we are connected to our, wi to our Wi-Fi network and print out our local IP address which we will be needing to ping to. Next up is our void loop. In here we can again check our connection status whether we are connected or not. And inside this if statement, we can print out that you can try to ping. And after this we can add a delay of 5 seconds. And to finish off add in an else statement in case we lose connection and add in a serial print for us to know. Now let's upload this and open up our serial monitor and as you can see we have connected to our Wi-Fi network and we can keep our connection up. Now now that this is done let's try and ping to the local ad local IP address from our computer and as you can see we are receiving a reply from the ESP32 confirming it is connected to the Wi-Fi network. If you don't have an ESP32 yet or you would like one extra then I'm happy to let you know that I will be giving away a new one. To take part check out the link in the upper right corner now or the link in the description. So that's it for today guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification so you won't miss out on the next video and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye world.